Well, as you're heading out the door, we have several major closures this morning due to flooding. I wanted to give you an overview of Metro Detroit. All of those red exclamation points you are seeing are some flooding in the area. I'm going to head over to our system so we can break it down for you. 696 right now, we are seeing closures. and I've been watching people forced off the road. This is westbound between Van Dyke and Mount and then the other direction in the same location. Now, as for Warren, we have flooding on Shaner as well between 10 and 12 mile roads. We have some flooding on Hoover. This comes to us in Macomb in both directions between 696 and 13 mile. In center line, Van Dyke in both directions between 696 and 13. And then in Warren again, Mound between 696 and 13 miles. We head east a bit. I am seeing flooding on 94 in addition to some closures. If you are heading in East Point, we are closed at 94 westbound. This comes to us between 10 and 9 mile roads. We're going to continue south where we have a disabled vehicle that is blocking two lanes. So if you're heading westbound at 94, we have a closure, but that's exactly where we have another closure just south of there that comes to us 94 eastbound between Maras and Vernier. As we continue south, we're closed in Harper Woods, 94 westbound in the other direction. This is between Vernier and Maras. So that stretch of roadway really closed this morning due to that flooding. I have some accidents this morning as well. Two lanes are blocked in Detroit. This is 94 westbound at East Outer Drive. And as we head further into the city of Detroit, some more flooding. This is 94 eastbound between 96 and 75. Just a bit over there, 94 westbound at the lodge. And I am seeing some flooding this morning as well. If you are heading on the lodge in Southfield, this comes to us between seven and eight mile road. So I have live pictures to show you of that 696 closure right now. If I can send it live outside right now, you can see this is our camera just west of Mound, where we are closed between Mound and Van Dyke. And you can see that people are being forced off the roadway. We are seeing flooding just about everywhere in Metro Detroit this morning. So as you're heading out the door, I have a full list of our closures and all of the flooding locations at WXYZ.com. I'm constantly updating that so you can head there throughout the morning for the most up-to-date list. I'll have an update on all of the roads in this flooding for you in seven minutes or less.